welcome back to the sims 3 hotel challenge so yeah i know i haven't uploaded this in uh, almost two weeks um mainly because one um the time the time when i was about to, was going to be recording it i went away for the weekend so i didn't really have time i had pre-recorded videos going up um two i started school so school has taken up a bunch of my time and three um, if you guys don't follow me on Twitter, I don't really talk about it too much on Twitter, but I've started playing Prison on Minecraft and it's just been a really big addiction and I just haven't been motivated to record Sims. So, that's basically my excuse that I don't really have anything else to say. It's my own fault, I should have been recording, but, like, the whole, like, me being away and school starting it, obviously, um, I've been working on school and stuff, so I'm focusing on school, but... That's beside the point. Let's go ahead and head into the Let's Play. So, I honestly don't remember what happened last episode because that was a while back. But I do not know why we only have 185 simoleons either. So, okay. Um, Alright, so we'll see who we have at work. Um, she's at work. She's at work. He's at work. And she's going to work. So, the only people that are home are... Caleb, Shirley, um, who else? And Isabel. So, what we're going to have her do is actually, I think I'm going to go ahead and send her off to the bookstore to go ahead and buy a few books so that she can go ahead. Oh, just kidding. She won't be able to buy books because she has no money. Hello? Um, don't put away leftovers. Come here. Where are you? Let me go see you. Okay, the only thing is with this Let's Play, I feel like them going to work is a bit boring. There's not much I can really do about it because it's part of it. Alright. I just loaded up my game, so it's a bit laggy at the moment, which I don't really enjoy. Ugh. But it should be fine. Um, and I kind of want to... Hold on, let me put this in her inventory. So, Tara went to her first day of work. You endured the pages of the book as you endured your duties as a test subject. It's admirable, plus you've learned mutation can be fun. Your relationship with your boss has improved as your job performance. As has your job performance, okay. So, I'm going to go ahead and stick this in her inventory. Let's use this bad. Yeah, clean that up. The thing is, like, with her, it's kind of hard to, um make sure that you get everything clean i don't know i feel like it's a bit difficult we're gonna go ahead and have him come down here and grab some breakfast um mo she's supposed to call for meal but there's really nothing yeah whatever i don't really care about doing this um grab a plate she wants to adopt a cat so because she is the cat herder 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 the cat herder um, I'm going to go ahead and actually have her adopt a cat. So, I think, yes, it's going to be an additional um, mouth to feed, but it's a cat, so we can deal with it. Um, let's go ahead and services and adopt a pet from shelter. So, we can go ahead and do that. As for her, okay, she's going to go ahead and clean the newspaper up. And I'm going to have her do the, let's go ahead and take rid of that. Oh, can we just sell this instead? I just want to sell it. Uh, yeah. Okay. To pay the bit. Uh oh. Uh oh. We didn't have enough money to pay the bills. Row. Ro. These guys better get working. Recycle. <gasps> I didn't know that. <laughs> oh god. So, Shirley, we're not, hold on, let me go ahead and hang the phone up for you, because we don't answer phones in The Sims. No, I'm just kidding, but phones are annoying. Anyway, let me go ahead and, oh, she's tired. So, you know what? Let's go ahead and see if she has anything else to really clean up around the house. She might have some laundry that she needs to do, but I'm probably not going to worry about that too much at the moment. Um, I don't know if making the beds is necessarily a, like, chore, I'm going to go ahead and have her do though that, make the beds. And after she makes the bed, I'm going to have her go ahead and sleep a bit. So over here, we have Caleb working on his music skill, which is good. So we can advance in that skill, which I really want. Um, 
Yeah, so she's gonna go ahead and make the beds, and then we can go ahead and have um, her clean up later, because she there's clothes on the floor and everything. And Shirley is gonna go ahead and adopt her cat now. Alright, let's see who we have. They load. Okay, so we have Alex. Maya. <gasps> Maya! We have Egon. Egon? Ratch. No, no, no. Is that really a name? Ratchet? Oh my gosh. <laughs> There's a cat called Ratchet. Like, how? Aww. This cat. It's Elder and Hyper Neat. Well, Ratchet, we would get you, but because you're Ratchet. No, I'm just kidding. I think Maya's adorable. I really want. I think I'm going to get Maya because Neil. She, they're, they're elders, and I kind of want a kitten. Well, this one's a kitten as well, but she's aggressive and noisy. And then this one's quiet and piggy. So I think we're going to go ahead and get Maya, guys. So let's go ahead and get Maya. Bye-bye, Ratchet. Are you sure you want to adopt? Yes. We're going to name her. We're going to keep Maya. I like Maya. Maya's being cleaned Shelba up and checked. Huh. Okay, looks like, uh, I don't know if you're happy or what it is. Um, Okay. So we're going to go ahead and send her off. No, 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 you can't clean. You can't clean. Ew. Oh, she's licking it clean. Girl, what do you think you are doing? All right, go ahead and use the bathroom. And, okay, I love how I adopted the cat, but nothing came up. Let's see, what are you up to? I think what we're going to go ahead and have him do is, I don't think he has work for a little bit. So, what I think we're going to go ahead and do, and since I said in the beginning, him and Tara don't necessarily have the best relationship, um, he kind of goes off and finds other women and stuff like that. So, what I think we're going to go ahead and do is go ahead and get him to eat up and then send him off into town and go ahead and see if we can find a sim for him to um, find, you know, be romantic with. Um... Now, he's not going to be necessarily in relationships. He's kind of go. Oh my god, I was going to say there's another one of her, but that's just a mirror. It's just a mirror. Um, did, he, did he disappear? Oh no, he's in the elevator, obviously. Hello? Um, but like I said, we're going to go ahead and send him off to find him a sim. So let me go ahead and set that up so that once he is done, we can go ahead and do that. Let's see. Should we send him off to just the... We might just send him here. Visit Civic Center Festival. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure if I put in the casino in here. What's this? Lucky... Oh, let's go to this instead. Let's go to the casino instead of the park. I think that... Oh, he has... Oh, never mind. We might not be able to make it because he has work. So maybe after work later tonight we'll be able to go ahead and take him there. Because as of right now, they're at work. And then her and Tara, um, she was flirting with Tara, so I think we're going to go ahead and have them be together. Because why not, right? Uh, spice it up a little bit here. Okay, um, who is that? Who is that? Tanisha Cisnero? Who are, oh, cause Maya, that's why. Where are you? He's complimenting her. Aw, be friends with Maya. Oh, she's coming to receive introduction. About, I think it's about the cat. Talk to pick a pet. Here's your new pet, Maya. Please love her and give her a wonderful home. So she, so Shirley has work, so she's gonna have to go ahead and go to work. And you guys didn't all adopt her. She got, they got money, so that's good. Um, he got 158. Lionel prevented a huge fiasco by stepping in and preventing a fellow soldier from unknowingly ordering 20,000 toilet handles just in the nick of time. He receives that hearty, a hearty recommendation for from his commander and. The thanks of his squad mate for saving his career. All right, so you can't be like that. Sorry, um, you can't be a firefighter either. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You have dreams. 
but I can't let you fulfill them. Um, so because this is not, like basically Shirley's cat, we're gonna go ahead and place the, the stuff for the kitten in her room. So I'm gonna go ahead and get the stuff for her. Let's go, oh, what's that? Bloodstone? The heck is that? What is that? Bloodstone? What is that? Huh? I can't pick it up. Oh no. What did I just do? Uh oh. Uh. Um. So, uh, I don't know what that is. And I don't think it's a good thing considering I can't pick up the object. Um, okay. I have no idea what that is. I'm actually scared now because what if it's something bad? I don't want anything bad to happen. Okay. Let's go ahead and place a little thing for her here. Um, let's get her a little kitty bed. What was this? Kitty bag. Kitty bag. And an ingenious design from your friends at Simina Pet Products. The kitty bag is a colorful cat and kitten enclosure that provides fun for felines and sims alike. Cats will delight in their cave like hideaway and allows them to lure and sim com companions in the for oh, I can't talk. In for a friendly tra tap or a ferocious scratch. Sims will marvel at the awe inspiring cuteness of this innovative product. I like it's like a fit. It's a catfish. Whoa. This is so cool. She's going to have like a little fish. She's going to be sleeping in. <laughs> oh, fish. Oh, that's funny. Okay. All right. And then let's go ahead and get her food bowl. Just get her a simple. Might as well get her like a blue food bowl to kind of match her bed. And I need to figure out how to get rid of this bloodstone because I'm scared that it's something bad. I wonder if I click on it, what will happen? Collect it. Oh. I guess it's nothing really special, I guess. I don't know. So she has to collect the cat. Okay, Casey has earned 222 simoleons. Where's... <gasps> Look at Maya! Dine with Claudia Parsons before time runs out to improve your relationship with your boss. Let's do that. Let's go ahead and have her dine out. Oh, look at Maya! She's so cute! Maya! Oh, Maya! She's adorable! Go ahead and, um, place her in Shirley's room, though. Cause it's Shirley's cat. So go ahead and, uh, wrong floor. Put her here. Uh, go ahead and place her, put pet down here. Put, or not. Nah. Where are, what are you doing? <laughs> and why aren't you asleep? I swear you're supposed to be sleeping. Unless she already slept, which I highly doubt. No, go ahead and pick up Maya. Pick up pet. Pick her up. Oh. Alright. And then go Shirley, why aren't you at work? Sorry about that. Um, so what was I saying? Uh oh yeah, Shirley is supposed to be at work and she isn't. But I think what we're gonna go ahead and do let's see how Alright, but they're pretty much tired. Um, let's go ahead and have him head to bed for- Oh, that's not his bed, so we can't have him sleep there. Let's have him go ahead and sleep. Because you're doing pretty much okay. Um, were you the one who's supposed to die? No, okay, go ahead and, um, work on- Alyssa Black Blalock wants to know if Wesley McKay would like to go on a date. Yeah, let's go ahead and have him do that. Discover potion. I don't even know who that is. Okay, you have to go to sleep. Let's just have you go to sleep. Sleep. And hopefully she'll be fine. Okay, is he going on the date? I guess he's going on a date. Where is he? Who is this person? 
Let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see. Is she even? Is this her? Alyssa Blalock. That, and that his boss is Marissa Ross. Okay, so she's really tired. Okay, she's exhausted. Hopefully everybody will be sleeping for the most part. Um, I don't know if he'll be able to go on that date for too much, for too long, because um, he's starting to get extremely tired and, you know, he's pretty important. He needs to get his rest and everything, so... I don't know how it's going to work out. And is she even home? Yeah, she is. Okay. So we're going to have her work on her potions because we need her to um, level up on her logic skill because we need her to do well in work. Um, but let's go ahead and follow Wesley to work. I mean, not work. What am I saying? To the date. Hopefully it's a good date, I guess. I don't know. She came, she came home to sleep as well. How about you? Everybody just, like, goes home to sleep. She's in the hot tub, just chilling. <laughs> Ooh, they're at the diner. Ooh. Can I go inside? No. Really? Why not? Where is this girl? Did she stand you up? I think she stood him up. Really? You know what? Wow. What does that say? A player's journey. The player's journey. Oh my gosh. Oh, he just. Oh, he's gonna come here and read his book, and like she didn't even show up. What a jerk. Oh, Wesley. It's okay. I think we're gonna go ahead and have him go home because you know what? She's not worth your time. If she's not gonna be here for you and you know wait for you then she's not worth it so we're gonna go ahead and have him head home and because everybody's pretty much asleep uh, let's see what do you need to work on for your job you think you need to work on your charisma skill yeah so i think we're gonna fiddle six casey oh no not again um sorry i'm got hung up on something maybe we can meet up again soon um sorry but uh no we're not Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and have. Is she sleeping? Yeah, she is. Okay. She, oh, she's hungry. Oh, man. <gasps> Look at Maya. She's so tiny. Alright, we need to go ahead and. Uh, let's see. What should we do? I'm, try I'm getting confused on which part of the bu building I'm in. Is she hungry? Yeah, she's hungry. Okay, Tara, because you're a sweetheart, we're gonna have you get out of the hot tub we're gonna have you pick up oh she wants to go in the kitchen Maya. oh look at maya she's so cute oh she's adorable i love her anyway we're gonna have her go ahead and pick up maya and then head upstairs and put her in there some people say that Cornelius Van Dien was a terrible guilty, has a terrible guilty secret. Could it really oh, be true? Who's this? Who are you, mister? What is this? I don't understand what this is. Is he at the du- The heck? Bark's, oh, Bark's Tavern. Oh, is that like a, um, a thingy? A place to like chill out? <laughs> chill out i think so all right did you pick her up pick her up pick her up i'm clicking on the wrong stuff that's why it's not working i'm like why can't i press play you're gonna pick come on pick her up pick up pet there we go and then go put her upstairs because we need you to feed her because Shirley isn't home yet. So go ahead and put Pet down here. Hopefully they can go through elevators. I mean, I would assume they can, right? I mean, it's not really like... If they can, that's going to be ridiculous. No, they can't. Yeah. I wonder if dogs, if they, if there's a dog like near an elevator, do the dogs like just teleport or do they go inside the elevator as well and go up? Hmm. I don't know. Buy a litter box. I have to buy a litter box for, um, I forgot about a litter box, actually. Let's go ahead and have her 
Oh, the built bow is filled. Okay, good. Which means that somebody else took care of it, which is awesome. So I'm going to go ahead and get the cat litter. Um, where is it? Here we go. And let's get the blue one because let's just match everything, you know? Just keep everything matchy matchy. All right. No, no, no. You're going to come over here. I'm going to go here and take care of your little kitty. All right, so Tara, I think we should go ahead and have you head to bed though. Um, this is your bed. I'm gonna go ahead and sleep. Okay. So guys, I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here. I know nothing too exciting really happened. Again, I'm trying to get back into the flow of recording um, Hotel Challenge again. So bear with me for the next few episodes. But thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.